Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I bring you guys my very first Halloween tutorial and it's a recreation of Avatar. So to start off with, I use the Baby Skin by Maybelline all over my face to kind of prime it up a little bit. Next I use this face paint white and blue. I got these from Holly, Hobby Lobby so I'm just mixing those two colors together and I thought it brought a really nice blue. Um, kind of like what Avatar has. Now a couple things I wanted to tell you guys um, that I didn't do here that I, I thought about afterwards is I do recommend for you guys to get an eyeshadow that's this color so you can set the color of your eyes a little bit better because you guys will see that it does crease a little bit. So in order for you to prevent that, either a translucent powder for your entire face or a um, eyeshadow for your face would work really well for you guys not have to for, so that you don't have to worry about the creasingness of the eyeshadow of the eyeshadow quote unquote. Now I, I do cut off my eyebrows a little bit and you're gonna see that and it doesn't and, and I didn't think it looked bad at all like in person either. Um, you kind of, I cut my arches off because Avatar did not have an arched eyebrow. So they had really round eyebrows so I just cut the arch off just to make my eyebrows look a little bit rounder. Now for the stripes on Avatar's face, I do recommend to get a nude pencil like this. I um, seen this on someone else's Halloween tutorial and I thought it was a brilliant idea because it shows you how to precisely mark your face if you are doing something like this because instead of you messing up and having to go back, you kind of know where you want things to go. So you just mark your face all up with a nude pencil, all the linings and all the stripes, precisely wherever you want them. And instead of having to erase the dark blue that I'm going to be putting on my face, I'm, all I have to erase is a nude color that I can easily cover with the face complex, the, the face paint that I already put on my face. So it makes it a little bit easier instead of having to replace the whole darkness that you have on your face. Now there's going to be a lot of corrections back and forth. But I don't show you guys all of them because I just felt like that would be a waste. But like you guys seen that I did like use the face brush the first time. And I corrected some of the linings. Here I'm using the blue that I mixed the other with the white. But I'm just using the dark blue to kind of make the stripes on my face. Now for this, I do did, I did like two and some of them. And I did two coats in some places and three coats in others. So you're gonna be the judge of that wherever you want things to go. And like I told you guys, you see me adjusting, like making the lights lines a little bit more precise. It's okay. You see that I don't have the lines, the line margin looking good. So I just keep going back and forth until you get everything right. And don't worry you guys, this is a Halloween tutorial, it's Halloween, things don't have to be perfect. Um, so just make it to your point that you feel comfortable with. And you see me, or I, you see me here, I'm just filling things back in, and the lines just keep messing up. I'll go back with the brush and adjust them. Now the sides where my foreheads are, I pretty much completely erase it at one point and then redo them. You don't see that, you're going to see it slightly on one side in a few seconds. But I didn't want to show you guys that, but like I said, there will be mistakes and all you have to do is erase them with that paint with the face brush and you will be fine. It's easy fixes, it's not hard at all, so just have fun with it guys. You see, I'm adjusting it a little bit here. 
Now for my nose, I've mixed black and white to create this grayish tone that I felt like Avatar had, like a grayish tone. And, for, and instead of having little white dots on my face, I thought it would be a little bit more glamorous to do these little diamonds. And I thought it was a really cute idea. I was going to put it all over my face and I was like, eh, not cute. I got these eyelashes. They're super dramatic on some website. They were only a dollar. And I was like, I'm never going to wear these in public, so I'll just use them for this tutorial. So I'm just going back, fixing the diamonds, doing tight line water lining. And for my hair, it's super basic. I put it in the middle and I just create braids all over the place. Here I'm using a ribbon, but in reality, I wouldn't use a ribbon. I just tried to see if it would come out because Avatar in the real video, in the movie, they do have um, like ribbons in their hair and they, their hair is braided more dramatically. But I didn't want to do that. I didn't like the outcome, so what I'm doing is I'm just doing random braids all over and that's pretty much it. So this is my completed avatar. I hope you guys enjoyed this recreation of avatar. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and thank you guys so so much for watching. Until next time, bye guys.